Hey everyone, it's Matin here from AppEngine.com again. Uh, this is another video in the Teespring Gem series. In this video, I'm going to be going through how to add a border to a font. Uh, sorry, a text. So again, if we're working with the Teespring, I'm just, I'm just going to write Teespring as the text. Um, make it nice and big. So we'll go 60. Yeah. And say we want um, to add a border to this text, right? So what we'll have to do is first of all add another layer. Um, and now I'll just select the text. And um, in in Mac, I've, I've set up all my my um, hotkeys so that. I just have to click the keyboard instead of using the mouse to select everything. So if I were to press Command E, which is Control E on a normal, normal um, non-Mac computer, so what that does is it expands the selection. So we've already selected this. So it's, what it's going to add is three pixels um, in every direction of that um, text, right? So I press OK. Um, I think you can find it over here. So expand, modify. Expand, there you go. So it's in select, modify, expand. So click that if you want. Now we select the border. So say we want a yellow border, and that's our empty palette. We color it in, unselect, move the layer at the back, and there you go. You've got a yellow border on the on the black text. So now if this was on a um navy type colored shirt or hoodie, whatever you prefer, it would look like that. Pretty cool, yeah? So you can do that on shirts, or I guess you can do it on banners and things like that, but um, it's really simple stuff once you get the hang of it. I mean, that literally took me about five seconds to do, maybe tw maybe five to 20 seconds, but um, it has a big impact if you can do it correctly.